We'll send it on out to Vic Stauffer for the call. They're off. Fast start for Emotional Kitten and Sarich. These two are quickest early. Between horses is Maka. Now Maka runs up into second as Sarich leads. Emollient goes to the rail and saves ground first time by the stands. Then Becky Liu, followed by Topic and Scarlet Strike. And the early trailer is Wittgenstein. One lap to go, and Sarich is doing it very easily. Sarich just on a canter into the clubhouse turn. She leads three quarters of a length from Maka in second. Emollient is perfectly placed by Mike Smith. In the Judmont colors at the rail and two from the front. Emotional Kittens a length behind her. Becky Lou has moved her way to the rail. Saves ground at the clubhouse turn fifth and four from the front. Topic and Garrett Gomez have six lengths to make up. Wittgenstein is out of last place. She is nine from the lead. And the trailer into the backstretch of the 12th American Oaks is Scarlet Strike. And she is 12 lengths behind the leader. And that is Sarich. Sarich is just cruising along up front. She's got an easy lead. She's went the first half in. 50 and 1 -fifth seconds and Sarich leads three-year-old fillies in the American Oaks up the backstretch. Mike Smith senses this slow pace and says let's go with Emollient and there goes Emollient outside of Sarich. So you can see Sarich have to quicken to maintain her head lead now from Emollient in second. Maka is third. She's only a length from those two. Then a length and three quarters back to Emotional Kitten and Becky Lou. More than that now it's four lengths back to those two. Then comes Topic. Scarlet Strike is still double digits from the front. She's outside of Wittgenstein and they round the far turn and Sarich and Emollient are pretty much even with a quarter of a mile to run. Maka is third and she's between horses still with a chance. Emotional Kitten is running up four wide. Here she comes. Emotional Kitten is after the new leader Emollient. Emollient has taken over the lead. Emotional Kitten trying to gun her down and she's only a half length behind. Emollient. Emotional Kitten getting closer. Topic is third. Emollient. Emotional Kitten. Emollient. Yes! Back at Betfair Hollywood Park, Amolia turf debut, a winning one and a great one winning effort in the turf debut in the American Oaks. Mike Smith, Bill Mott, and Judd Montfarm. Yeah, she's a two-time grade one winner now. Very valuable filly, especially when she goes to the breeding shed. And for me, the key moment in the race didn't happen to the wide, didn't happen down the stretch. It happened midway down the backside by Hall of Famer Mike Smith. That's why he's such a good big money rider. You can see Emollient. She's sitting in third. Now you can see the two horses that are setting the pace in front of her, the one. And it looked like if Mike had stayed on the rail, he would have been boxed in. You see now the four has dropped back behind him. Right there, he angles to the outside. Big, long striding filly. He doesn't want to get it jammed up and hemmed, up, hemmed in on the rail. He angles to the outside and he goes up and engages the front runner because he knows they're going slow. And for me, that was the key moment. A great ride, a heads-up move by Mike Smith. It was, because you know Difference what it ended up doing? Yeah, and you know what it ended up doing? It ended up drawing the four into the race because it quickened up the pace, but he had a ton left. And if you watch the gallop out, it looked like nobody was really going by. Actually, the eight topic, the one that was coming out of the main wind, really galloped out strongly for Garrett Gomez. But yeah, Hall of Fame ride by a Hall of Famer. And how many times do we do shows and talk about this, but uh, there's no one better right now in a big race in a grade one, Mike Smith, we keep calling yeah. his name. Him and Gary Stevens yep. putting on a show. Yep. So, well done to the connections of Amoyan. Again, Bill Mott, Mike Smith, Judd Mott Farms, and the future very, very bright for this Philly by Empire Maker. That is it for various networks across the country. He's been joining us here on Trackside Live for Simon Bray, Paul LaDuca. I'm Greg Wolf. Thanks for joining us. Amoyan takes the American Oaks. TVG, we're coming right back.